There are now six cases of people who have been cured after receiving a bone marrow transplant from a donor who's naturally resistant to HIV. So about 5% of Caucasians are naturally, naturally resistant to HIV because they lack the receptor that HIV needs to get inside the cell. It's like a lock and key. And if you don't have the right lock and key fit, the virus can't get in. And the lock and key for HIV is something called CCR5. And about 5% of people don't have that CCR5 gene. This is uh, unusual and it's, um, it's not the first time people have tried a transplant with a CCR5 wild type donor. There were two very famous cases back dating back to 2013 that were done that had two people that received these transplants in Boston. And they had a period of no viral rebound, but it was short-lived. You know, in under six months, the virus was back. So this is long-lived at 18 months. So um, lots of um, further work needed to understand why this person has not rebounded. Every one of these cure cases, although they are rare, give people great hope, particularly people living with HIV and all the scientists working with HIV and all the clinicians that treat HIV because all of us want to see a cure one day.